Duris. 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 Thank you. This is not fair. I don't do damage to my enemies. And Duris one-shots them. Like a goddamn Cretan creature. I... Well, at least we know we can complete quests this way. And we can go out and fight things in the world. And somebody was giving me uh, shit a couple episodes ago, and it's like, Dude, just go get some good weapons, then you'll be okay. Like, you're... The game's not bad. You're just bad at the game, and you're not you're not using uh, the right weapons for this. Oh, hey, I can actually hurt the raptors now. Not that it really matters, um, but like, you do realize that there's like very very strict leveling requirements, right? And like, oh, who are these people? Mutants? Forlorn. Well, the last time we fought the forlorn, they kicked my ass. But I've gained f what five levels since. Might actually be able to fight them now. If you know Duras can hit. Okay, come on, Duras. Hit him. Drink a potion just in case. My god. He got stupid. Come on, Duras. Keep fighting him. I'm just gonna play the game like this, aren't I? Where'd the other one die? Oh, he, here he was. Like, I, I'm not... I don't think I'm ever actually going to fight anything in this game. I'm just going to be kiting them so that my companion characters can fight them instead. This is kind of pitiful. And I don't really understand why. Oh, <laughs> uh, man. I'm just glad that I can actually explore the world and... Uh, you know, not... Just get killed every time. Ooh, we got a battle axe. Well, that's useful. But yeah, so like, no matter how much how much I like could cheese to get money and stuff like that, I am entirely at this game's mercy for uh like gated equipment, which is unfortunate. Okay, so I can ah right, I can make wood lice meat dish. And fried meat. 49 fried meat. Okay, well, there's there's healing items and spades. Let's keep wandering around and fighting things, seeing as, like, I effectively just have... I. This is like one of those MMO situations where you have the high-level player running around and helping the lower-level player and just kicking ass. Like, this is 100% that. Which amuses me to no end. I just have, I just have murder buddy, murder buddy Duris. Now all I have to do is get like a cleric, somebody with a, a sniper rifle. Oh man, if I could actually like set one of these guys to aggressive, we could actually potentially fight things. I was hoping I could find a teleporter in here, but it seems like, um, huh. At that point I just swim. It seems like we're pretty, uh, teleporter-free, just for a little while. Because, yeah, if I could actually start warping or, uh, warping back to these guys, that'd be really nice. But I do not see a warp pad. Well, anyway, fix your problem. I took care of the Alps that were hunting you. You took them on? On your own? Then we are fortunate the Alps made the mistake of trying to kill you. Who would have thought that we would fight shoulder to shoulder as defectors? Perhaps we can save more of our old comrades by fighting against them instead of alongside them. I assume these other guys have nothing to say. They're just separatists. Yeah, so we'll have to go back and talk to, um... Well, there's Poison Merc over there. Yeah, so I'm probably going to have to give up on that idea. I'll keep exploring around here. This could it be looks dangerous. like... 
looks like having a shield equipped more or less makes it so I don't have a heavy attack anymore. But I can knock enemies down with some level of, uh, with some level of frequency, which is kind of nice. No, I don't want to go back to main menu. I'm not done yet. I'm playing this game in about ha uh, hour and a half bursts every night. Okay, so we got a couple of things. We've got a, a forlorn and we've got a troll. Now, the last time I tried fighting a troll, I we got murdered hard. I'll get this one. Okay. I'll get this one. <laughs> what? I, I. Is something wrong? Something's got to have broken, right? Like, there's no way. I've seen him take multiple hits to kill guys before. But... I'll help you. Did... Did I just... Did I break Dura somehow, or does he just scale based on... Because I'm not able to one-shot things with the book, But he just one-shots trolls! We just have a regular rot bore there. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, dude. Not a good time to just turn around. Okay. We killed that one. You got all of them. I may have actually done a fair amount of damage to the Mo Rot Moloch. But... I'm not Durus. Huh. I... Did I... How? I don't know. Oh, hey, we've got a warp point here. Outside of a... Creepy cave... It was also covered in mo- I, I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. Got a critter there. At least- at least I can reasonably fight some of these guys, but... We're still a ways off of actually being able to do so on our own. Rat! What the- Are you serious? <laughs> the rats have more HP. Uh, I'll get this one. I uh, Well, I mean If I'm going to be mad about the Euro Jank. Uh-oh. I'll take care of that. Ow. Well, I can fight the exiles. What what am I doing? Okay. Going melee. Bleeding hard. Okay. So there's exiles here. Oh shoot. Didn't mean to drink a potion. I actually meant to pull out my weapon. Not that it makes a difference. Yeah, on one hand the Jake on this game makes me rather ultra cranky. On the other hand, well, I mean, we seem to have run into a situation where I am, um, the most powerful. So yeah, we've got a bunch of exiles here. But they might just be random enemies. Ah, I did see a potion back here. And a gold nugget and a couple other things. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do about this situation. Like, on one hand, I feel real bad that I'm, like, 
abusing this to this degree. On the other hand, like, I don't know if I could... Well, I mean, right now, I definitely couldn't do this. Yeah, no, this lady was just an exile. I, I, I thought I had found it like a... Challenging. What could be? There's just a bunch of weird torture chambers. Like, this is creepy as shit. Don't get me wrong. But... I don't know. I don't know, whatever, I'll just... I'll just keep looking around. But yeah, if I want to actually play this game normally, I might actually have to turn... Uh... To send... Duras away. I just... I don't... I don't know what to do. Why do rats take so many hits to kill? So, where are those Alps? What Alps? I used a combo to kill a rat. I... I don't... I don't know how to react to any of this, man. I... Locked chest. One of the harsher things to deal with is... So whenever I'm playing a game that's kind of this janky, and I'm like trying to express my frustrations with it, a lot of people like to, um... In the light of the panic that has broken out in the last few hours, the corporation will provide you with emergency transport to bring you and your family to safety. I don't like saying it, but there is a high chance that law and order will break down completely as soon as the real truth is learned. There won't be many survivors, but the corporation will make sure that you are amongst them. So, old, old world audio logs and stuff like that. Like, when I'm playing games this janky, uh, and I, like, try and express my frustrations with, uh, how things are going because they are going real weird, uh, I get a lot of people that actually give me a silly amount of flack for it. You know, more or less just blaming me for, uh, for having problems with the game as opposed to, like, even contending with the idea that this could be, a, like, a really broken, flawed product. Um... I don't really know how to react to those, because, like, I'm just trying to be honest and, like, genuine here. And I hate the idea of, like, really masking my, my opinions, my... my observations, just so that I don't offend people. Magalan is a truly amazing place. The hell is up with this place? It's freaking creepy. Like, I'm gonna- I'm- I'm almost immediately going to get people, uh, yelling at me for, uh, for using Duris as- as my murder- murder posse. I wonder if all of the, uh, companions are, or if I just somehow broke him, or he's just inherently broken, or any number of things, I don't know. Uh, but somebody's gonna get real mad at me for using Duris as- as that. Maybe a lot of people. Um, and these are probably gonna be the same people that- are mad at me for, like, not understanding the game and, uh, not playing it right and stuff like that. And it's like, you are what dead. am I supposed to do? Okay, she has a cool-ass looking sword. I am go. going to be in trouble if they hit me. Okay, I can actually fight these people. But... I don't need to. Yeah, we don't even get their swords. It makes me sad. They have cool swords that we just don't even get. Then again, this game would probably be really ridiculous if I just could get swords from everybody that I killed. No trace of the Alps here. Where are they? What quest am I supposed to be doing here? I'm like very far off the beaten path and doing who knows what. Hunting bow. Ooh. 
Nice part is, by doing this, uh, we're gonna get some of the gear that I would've had to spend a decent amount of money on. Yeah, do I have a quest here to go find Alps? Oh, not that one. It's not that one. better be on our guard here. Okay. Yeah, I'm sequence breaking, I think. Ew. I'm gonna raid the dirty sink for its bits. Well, whatever. I mean, each gets me an arrow. This feels weird. Do we have anything else here? I, I feel like I'm doing this... Well, I mean, I'm obviously doing it wrong. I don't have the, uh, the necessary quest. Just also not sure what I'm supposed to do. Okay, well... I Isopod? I was dead. Did it let me get the... No. Oh, but it does give me wood lice meat. It's like a vid doc come true. When the world will end, when comets attack, 20 more ways Magellan will end. I told them the government was hiding something. They're always hiding something. I bet you one of them is behind us. Some political shit gone crazy or something. Hmm. Yeah, we got a sweet looking tree. I think I'm gonna have to leave though. Like, this place is actually really neat, but I don't have the quest for it and it's very confusing. Like, I almost feel like I should, I should, uh, use and abuse the, the possibility of, possibility? I, I should use and abuse the fact that I've got, uh... Stop messing around with that thing! Death cannon, okay. If I do that, that sends me up here, I guess. Let's see, searching for clues. Let's mark that on the map. Who the hell is hacking? Oh. Well, let's go talk to Ragnar. Unfortunately, this game does not exactly um, describe all like potential quests that I have going, so I might have the sub-objective to talk to this guy, but not really. How is your war against the Alps going? Our war? This isn't a war of our choosing. They attacked us. Then they sent a party to construct a converter in the north of Edan. You'll find the metallic ruins of it there. And the soil around that monstrosity holds the bones of the Alps that came with it. Since then they have raided, rather than try to hold ground in Edan. But who knows where and when they will strike next. Here, or in Tavar, or Ignadon. The war has hurt them, no doubt. Even their own kind has rebelled. There's a group of Alb separatists to the north. They continue their love of Elix machines, but they are fighting their own kind. Let's assume I help you out. Yes? What kind of special tasks would you have for me? Special tasks? Why would you figure that I need someone who can do more than just the usual? Because I see what's going on here. <laughs> Is it that obvious that we have some problems here in Goliath? Yes, it's apparent. I have to admit I underestimated you. At least you're observant. But it also takes guts to confront me. Hmm, so you really want to help us out? Yes. There are many things to be done. Our people are dedicated. But we still have supply shortages. Food, medicine, machine parts, and other equipment. There are too few cultivators in the fields. 
Speak to the people here, and they can tell you where your skills are best used. Earn their trust, and you may earn mine. And if you're planning to join us, then I will have a very special task for you. A lot of people come to me, looking to join us, to climb the ranks. You look like you have ambition. If you earn my trust, you'll go far here. About my support. What do I need to do? Ask around the city. Help the people here. Some are over. Lend them a... And that... Don't do it. How am I doing? Drogue put in a good word for you. But you impressed the wrong man. Others have paid for taking his word before now. You will need more than his word to gain promotion. You have passed Angram's test. That stands you in good stead. You helped protect the seedlings from mutants. My wife doesn't trust you. That doesn't give me confidence in your motives for being here. I've heard you helped the cleric escape from Goliath. And worse still, you involved my wife in this deception. How does that speak to your case? It seems you weren't able to find the stolen elix for Caldrum. You must do more if you want to fit in here. Earn those pledges, and you will earn my approval. So... You play with your tech somewhere else. It's forbidden here. There's a bunch of ones. Okay, so that's just... That's meaningless. Law of the Berserkers. Waiting. Necessary for survival. Oh, here we go. Uh, this just showed up. I don't think we had that earlier. So we gotta go talk to Angram specifically. I believe that's Angram. Well, easy enough. Uh, if I can properly sprint. There we go. Yeah, we do have a bunch of new weapons, too. Let the me take a look at that. such technology. Okay, so we have a battle axe, which requires 46 strength. 32 constitution would be so bad, but the battle axe is going to be hard to get. We also got a hunting bow, which requires 41 dexterity. Oof. Well, it's a 9 damage bonus. Really only a 9 damage bonus? How the hell am I ever going to be able to do as much damage as Durus? Unless Durus really is bro- I don't know. I don't know. But let's go talk to Angram. Not Angram. We're here to talk to Hacken. I'll quick save just in case. I found the Alps. So, they are scouting those locations. They must be planning another attack. Did you kill the scouts? Or are you here to ask for help? I spoke with them. To the Albs? And you're still alive? No, no, you're full of shit. Albs don't speak to anyone. They're Alb separatists. They don't take orders from Zaycor. Separatists? What are you talking about? The separatists don't want to fight you. You should talk to them. They're good fighters looking for allies to bring down the Alexiters. Allies? This stinks of a trap. It's no trap. They want your help. They're fighting the Alps to put an end to the bloodshed. To get rid of the Alexiters. You're serious? Alps that want to fight Alps? Well, if they want to give up the fight, then it is my job to give them a welcome. Tell me where you found them. They're to the west, where you said they would be. I'll send a few men to these uh, separatists to see what their intentions really are. If they're lying, they will pay with their lives. But if they're telling the truth, then maybe we berserkers have found the allies we need to defeat the Alps. Here, take this as payment for your help. That was well done. 
Okay, so what do I need for this battle axe? Seeing as. So constitution, 32. And the rest into strength. And a little bit of con... con uh, not constitution, dexterity. I mean, I might as well. Uh, let's see, does this guy have any new training for me? I've got... Yeah. I got some money now. Armor... This is a long way off. Intelligence, got to work on that. Good eater, could actually be really good, actually. And we've already got these. Yeah, let's get good eater. That'll save me a fortune in potions, probably. We should not rely on machines. Oh yeah, we also have these: scanner, drone, force push. So how much does a large healing potion heal? 160. How much does a woodlice meat dish? So the small healing potions that I've been using heal 40. Woodlice meat dish heals more. But it's slower. That's the uh that's the deal. Either way, I'm going to equip that over the um I'm going to equip that over the the potions, because that means I should be able to just use... Well, not use. I I should be able to... That tech's going to get you in trouble. Put it away or dispose of it. I really hate being here. Okay, you know what? Maybe that's the last thing we, we do for, for tonight. Let's check the map. I can't imagine this working. Well, we do have a couple of things we can do. Okay, let's let's save proper. I'm just going to use and abuse save, uh, saving as much as much as I can. Okay, there's a couple of alb here. Get ready. This place doesn't feel too friendly. Might be able here, to kill them. The berserkers defeated the albs and wrecked their converter. Question is, why did we let them build it here in the first place? Okay, they're not killing me nearly as fast, which is helpful. In fact, these guys aren't too hard at all. Okay. Good. Oh, I killed them. To be recognized. I don't actually know if I killed them. I think, honestly, Duras killed them. Okay. So we're healing. We ran into that. We've got that quest out of the way. Yeah, okay, so I'm not as useful as I thought. The hell is this thing? But I'm still pretty useless. What is this? Is that a... A fighting colossus? Uh... Duris. Duris. Why are you? My god, he killed it in one hit. He's broken. He's literally glitched. He has to be. There's no way you can one shot that thing. Okay. <laughs> I give up. Let's let's only abuse his help for a little bit longer. Maybe I don't know. I don't know what to do. Maybe maybe restarting the game will will solve the problem. He really is in just insta murder mode. Weird. Anyway, I'm going to let's see. I'm gonna set that there. So I believe that's the cleric encampment all the way to the north. 
Originally, I was going to uh, run this, but it seemed to have gone poorly. Now, he's there. He wants me to find his weapon. I'm going to do that later, maybe when Durus isn't broken. I just want to see if I can get to the clerics area and uh, start outfitting, uh, start doing the quest for that. Yeah, okay, I'm actually starting to do more damage here. Couple Sometimes a couple more levels. Those things offer a dry, safe place to sleep in. That can be worth a lot out here in the wilderness. Yeah, a couple more levels like that, we might actually be able to um we might actually be able to start solo adventuring or, you know, fighting things. I'm noticing less enemies have skulls and I'm actually able to hurt them. I mean the uh the Alps the things our world has achieved that are now lost to us. The elves we saw earlier are a perfect example. But yeah, so we're just gonna fight uh, whatever we can. Along the way. Ultimately, uh, Durus is still going to be uh, Captain Ridicu Ridiculoso. Ridiculoso? Yeah, sorry, Ridiculoso. Uh, the entire way through, and <laughs> that's not fair. But we'll get there. And if we don't fully get there, I mean, hopefully we fix them. And if we don't fix them, then I can always switch them out. Either that or companion characters are truly and irredeemably broken. Which, I mean, if they are broken, if every companion character is just... Wait, what? Oh, it's metal scrap. For a second I thought it said, like, a megaton shot or something. I don't know. I read it as definitely not metal scrap. I got really excited for a moment. Um, it looks like there's a lot of, like, interesting forts and stuff like that. I'll, I, I'm looking forward to going after them, especially once I am better equipped for it all. These are the things we're fighting for. I'll get now, this, this is a jackal. It's a little bit harder. Quote-unquote. I mean, if it weren't for, uh, one-shot Mc... Doodle pants. This would be a lot harder. I could always turn up the uh, the combat difficulty, but I don't think that's gonna fix Duras. Yeah, I'm not gonna go out of my way for EXP here. If I if I need to, I will. But I actually, I don't want to get sidetracked. I don't want to get distracted. I don't want to get roped into stuff. Uh, cause I'm I'm hoping I can walk up to the uh, the cleric area and effectively do a bunch of their fetch quests next because I've got to assume most quests don't really involve combat that much you know a number will for sure uh, but if I'm lucky I can actually go to the cleric section uh, get a good feel if I like them or not uh, get a good feel if I like them or not uh, and start progressing towards them and ju just do all of their uh, all of their fetch quests. And if I'm lucky, I'll get a couple levels from that, and then by the time I'm done fetch questing for everybody, I'll actually be ready to take on the world proper. Ah, I killed, killed my biter. Come on. There is. Thank you, one one punch man. One one stab man. Yeah, the more money and the more meat we can get, too, the better. Like, most critters give me one to two meat per kill. That's incredibly helpful. All right, so that's a ripper. Eh, same amount of EXP. Part of the reason why I don't feel too bad about this is... No matter what... Uh, we kill, it's only, like, a small amount of EXP. Well. Maybe? This feels a bit... I'll much. Now it's only 125. <laughs> uh, this is dumb. Look out! 
Yeah, I'm gonna try and go uh, go out of my way to avoid too many of these guys, because free, f truly free XP feels maybe a bit dirty. But at the same time, it will save me a lot of trouble in the long run. So I'm gonna go up to the base of the volcano and then go around it. I eesh. This is a trip. Yeah, I'm beginning to realize they just kind of smatter every type of creature all over the map here. Duris. Bringing you along, man, to keep me alive. This is not a good time for lollygagging. He lollygags as hard as possible. Mind you, it's kind of ridiculous. So that's the volcano. Yeah, so we're going we're gonna try and take a left whenever we get the chance. I'll get Chris? The yeah. I'll Oh, this is why we've got all this steak. Yeah, because even killing that guy just gives me uh, one piece of steak. Getting that, getting that healing training, absolutely worth worth doing. This is a neat game, despite all of its faults. It's got some neat ideas. Who's that guy? Connor. Okay. He seems like an interesting fellow. Unfortunately, we've... Oop. They're not hostile. You see the desert down there? Dust, rock, and the ashes of our past. <laughs> I hate deserts. I'll save you the trouble of looking around. This place has already been picked clean, so don't waste your time here. You'll do better elsewhere. And what did you find? A few bits of scrap, a few shards. Nothing worth the time I've spent. I got lucky because someone had stashed their finds over there. So at least I got some reward. Here, take some water. You might as well not go home completely empty-handed. And don't worry, it's clean. Any animal that tries to piss in the well here ends up fried. Right, enough with the talk. I need to feed my mutt. I wonder what this used to be. Why build a house where only some rooms away. have walls? Where are those guys? I don't know. I kind of want to find out. Are they hostile or are they not? Are they traitors? If they're traitors, then I want to talk to them. Hello, stranger. If you want to... What do you have? Everything. Okay, so he has stuff to sell. He actually has decent stuff. Uh, serrated axe seems pretty useful. Scrap shield. Well, what do I have? So I have... Oh. I picked up an axe that's actually a fair bit better than what I've got. Okay, so the axe... Well, fair bit. Do two more damage. I don't know. Okay. So the serrated axe is another two. I could use it in a level if I wanted to. Maybe? I'll think about it. Let's look at armor. So there's the miner shirt. The miner shirt's better than what I had. Hunter... Lifeblood, no. Amulet of Camouflage. I'll pick that up at the very least. The other stuff is kind of interesting, but in a couple levels I'll have better stuff anyway. But yeah, now uh, the main reason why I was so set, dead set on talking to him uh, is... Now we uh, now we have him marked as a merchant, so if we ever see him going by, I can stop by and buy or sell stuff. Because eventually I'm going to start ranging out pretty far. Do you have anything to sell? Sell? No. I'm no good as a trader. I tried it once, but in the end, it just brought me trouble. Guys who couldn't pay. Guys who bargained over every last shard. I don't want to deal with that sort of shit. So there's nothing you want to trade? Well, if you can get some raw meat, I'll trade you something. Snuffles over there could do with something better to eat than old shoe soles. Sure. I'll get you some meat. Okay. A half dozen cuts should be enough. I got the meat you wanted. And still fresh. Great. Here. 
Some shards from my emergency stash. Uh, sorry about the smell. I keep them in my... boots. Still, should keep them safe from thieves. And Snuffles there will appreciate the meal. Excellent. Okay, well. Uh, is that a raptor? Raptor? No, that's a, that's a dead raptor. I don't have to worry about it. Okay. Well, we're done with this. Just random dead skeks. And we're not even halfway. We're like, well, no, no, no. I'd say we're at about the halfway point. Okay, cool. So this won't take too long to traverse. I'm just hoping we don't run into too many big and bads while we're out and about tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah.